this is Aurindam Ghosh again uh, back with the next part of uh, deconstruction. I am talking about Jacques Derrida and his uh, philosophy of deconstruction. Uh, in the previous lecture, in the part one of this particular lecture, I've titled, I've already told you that I've titled this lecture on the heart of a decentered planet, Jacques Derrida and the story of deconstruction. I've talked about who Jacques Derrida is, uh, what are the uh, various influences upon Jacques Derrida, understanding Derrida's life is very important, and what are the various socio-political events that shaped Derrida's life. Derrida was uh, an Algerian Jew, uh, a Jew born on Algeria, and uh, various socio-political events that shaped Derrida's life, among them are Algerian War of Independence, there are uh, the influence of the French president return to the uh, return of Charles de Gaulle into power, and then there is obviously the famous event of the French student movement of May 1968. Of course, there is the influence of Stalinism and uh, uh, the formation of the various uh, colonial empire in the Eastern European states. Upon the reader, there are, of course, the intellectual influence of the phenomenological schools and the Telquel group, the group of the French, uh, of the writers who wrote French new novel or nouveau roman. And of course, uh, there uh, is the influence of the structuralist thinking. Uh, talking about the ambiguous nature of language itself, I'm talking about how language is itself very slippery in nature. I'm giving you various examples and uh, uh, I'm, uh, uh, throughout my lecture I'm discussing about how uh, there is a, a kind of arbitrary relation between the signified and signified. Uh, Sasu talked about this arbitrary relation between the signified and the signified. Very the uh, talking about uh, rupturing all forms of union between the signified and the signified. He said that there is only play of signifiers and there is no such signified uh, monolithic conception of signified, unified monolithic conception of signified as such. And I've uh, discussed with you what is reconstruction. Reconstruction is basically encouragement of alternative meanings. Uh, I have in fact uh, read with you one uh, piece of poem. Uh, one decon I, I've, tried, uh, I, I'm, I've tried to give you uh, one deconstructive interpretation of a poem, deconstructive reading of the poem Kubla Khan. And then uh, uh, I will now discuss uh, with you uh, about the scope and the impact of deconstruction, uh, in which book Derrida talks about deconstruction and how uh, uh, deconstruction changed the landscape of the uh, Western metaphysics and landscape of the Western philosophy and how Derrida changed it. So Derrida's 1967 book, Derrida, uh, first published in uh, a book in the year 1967. Remember, Derrida wrote his first book at the age of 37. He was born in 1930. But quite uh, very uh, to our surprise, Derrida published almost three books in the year 1967 itself. He published On Grammatology in 1967. He published Speech and Phenomena in 1967. And Writing and Difference published in the same year. So that's quite a surprise thing for us. So there is a 1967 book of Grammatology introduced us to this entire system of deconstruction. So deconstruction contains that any text, in any text there are inevitable points of equivocation or ambivalences or ambiguities or undecidability that betray any stable meaning. As I am already saying that deconstruction tries to destabilize language and this undecidability betray any stable meaning that an author might seek to impose upon his or her text. The construction or uh, uh, on that purpose post-structuralism, all the post-structuralist thinkers saw author almost as a figure of authority. For example, Rolabart, Rolabart wrote his famous essay, The Death of the Author. 
here the death of the author is the corollary of the birth of the reader it's almost a freedom for uh, the the post structuralist thinker to je kono post structuralist thinker er kachei author jeno ekta meaning system ke provide kore ebong she tari maner poshara sajiye sei mane ta jor kore ekjon reader er upore ba jon perceiver ba audience er upore jor kore chapiye jay ei je reception reception esthetic er je কথাটা রিডার রেসপন্স থিওরি যে কথা যে একজন অথরের একটা পার্টিকুলার টেক্সটকে দেখার যে চেষ্টা সেটা একটা রিডারের দেখার চেষ্টা কোনো দিন এক হতে পারে না সেই চেষ্টার মধ্যে ডিফারেন্স থাকবেই দিস প্রসেস অফ রাইটিং অলওয়েজ রিভিউলস দ্যাট দ্যাট হুইচ হ্যাজ বিন সাপ্রেসড কভার্স ওভার দ্যাট হুইচ হ্যাজ বিন ডিসক্লোজ অ্যান্ড মোর জেনারেলি বিচেস দ্য ভেরি অপোজিশনস দ্যাট আর থট টু সাসে so there is always already a kind of opposition a kind of binary opposition that plays inside a text the text er moddhe prothom thekei ekta binary opposition prothom thekei khela korche the main function of a deconstructionist is to unravel this play ei je play ta ei je opposition ta prothom thekei ekta text er moddhe royeche take reveal kora to Uh, the reader it is chosen deconstructionist but a critiker main one so there is a profound history of deconstruction in the book of grammatology short question asked by in which book there is for the first time use the term deconstruction in his book of grammatology now there is a says that there is a violent hierarchy of binary opposites what is binary opposite binary opposite for example good and evil uh, for example black and white For example, speech. I mean, the way I'm writing, writing. These are the opposite binary opposite. Our the Western metaphysics, Western theology, or Western philosophy. Which one is going to act as a polarizer? Which one is the binary opposite? Which one is going to act as a choose? Which one is going to polarize? Which one is going to say this is better? So, in Western philosophy, there is always good is evil. Good is always better than the evil. যদিও ইভিলের মধ্যে একটা ভয়ঙ্কর অ্যাট্রাকশন রয়েছে একটা ভয়ঙ্কর মাল্টি ভ্যালেন্স রয়েছে একটা এক ধরনের ডিসকোর্স রয়েছে যেটা আমাকে অ্যাট্রাক্ট করে আমাদেরকে শেক্সপিয়ারের হ্যামলেট থেকে শুরু করে ম্যাগমেট থেকে শুরু করে ইভিলের একটা অ্যাট্রাকশন রয়েছে কিন্তু ওয়েস্টার্ন মেটাফিজিক্স বা ওয়েস্টার্ন ফিলোসফি সবসময় গুড লাইট ওভার ইট প্রমোটেড গুড ওভার ইভিল ইট প্রমোটেড লাইট ওভার ডার্কনেস ইট প্রমোটেড স্পিচ ওভার রাইটিং ইট অলওয়েজ so it creates kind of binary opposition okay so words are binary opposites as i have already told you between good and evil between mind and body it always uh, favors mind over body mind over matter matter mani body jar moddhe ashol pran nei mon je bhavna chinta kore tar moddhe ashol pran hoy kojito eta dekhar to korche amra jodi প্লেটনিক সাবস্টেন্সের কথা বলি অ্যারিস্টটেলিয়ান প্লেটনিক এসেন্সের কথা বলি অ্যারিস্টটেলিয়ান সাবস্টেন্সের কথা বলি আমরা কার্টেশিয়ান কজিটের কথা বলি ওর এলিয়াটিক টোটালিটি প্রত্যেকটাই এই মাইন্ডকে প্রেফার করি গ্র্যান্ড ন্যারেটিভের কথা বলি স্পিচের কথা বলে রাইটিংয়ের কথা বলে না তুমি যেটা মুখে বলবে সেটাই শেষ কথা কারণ তুমি যখন মুখে বলছো তুমি ভেরিফাই করে নিতে পারছো অরিন্দম ঘোষ যখন কিছু একটা বলছে মুখে বলছে তখন তুমি অরিন্দম ঘোষকে জিজ্ঞেস করতে পারছো স্যার এটার মানে কি otherwise the reader must present thakche na writing it ami kono ekta notes di jodi ekta lekha kichu ekta dilo je likheche the writer is not present jokhon i writer present thakche na writing is basically a two way communication it's a it's a two way communication jekhane sender ebong receiver du dike royeche ebong sender ebong receiver er majhe writing royeche for example jokhon receiver writing to receive koreche sender di abar jokhon sender likche tokhon receiver di So in the absence of this, both two poles of communication, writing is collapsing. Writing is collapsing. Writing is encouraging ambivalence. Writing is encouraging equivocation. Writing is encouraging an essential ambiguity. Writing in the middle of a puzzle. If you have to solve a puzzle, if you have to solve a puzzle, the reader himself or herself becomes an autonomous entity. reader himself or herself becomes an autotelic entity reader can read or misread his or her own text in a own way death of the author of the mrittu korche tumi tokhon author er uchcha 
a particular way of controlling the text by the reader পছন্দ করছে না ওয়েস্টার্ন ফিলোসফি তারা চায় সব সময় অথর কন্ট্রোল করুক কোন একটা কন্ট্রোলার কোন একটা অথরিটি থাকুক কোন কিছুর উপরে রিডার যেন ডেমোক্রেটিক ওয়েতে কোন টেক্সটের অধিকার না পায় সো ওয়েস্টার্ন ফিলোসফি অলওয়েজ প্রমোটস দিস ফর্ম অফ বাইনারি অপজিশন লাইক গুড এন্ড ইভিল লাইক মাইন্ড এন্ড বডি লাইক স্পিচ এন্ড রাইটিং এন্ড ইউজুয়ালি ওয়ান সাইড ইজ ভ্যালুড हायर দ্যান দ্য अदर দিস ক্রিয়েটস ডিফিকাল্টিস দ্যাট দি কনস্ট্রাকশন ইজ करेक्ट deconstruction is trying to deconstruct or enter inside this violent hierarchy and tries to correct it by deconstructing these binary oppositions we are able to uncover the foundation of the dikhte bahu je foundation je bhiter modde ashole ki ache building the own structure to pore dali ache on which structure this entire building of the western metaphysics and western teleology is stand So there is the argument that philosophical traditions were largely marginalized, and with the application of the deconstruction, it is possible to express what has been repressed these traditions through a deconstructive, a deconstructive reading. We can unravel these various binary opposition and can try to have a look into the foundation. The own genius gulo, a foundation and mudde repressed hoye pore ache. Own tradition gulo ke. Western philosophy, such as Stoic tradition, ni bolo, the pre-Socratic jago no philosophical tradition ni bolo, own tradition group will repress it, oppress it, core that over build it. Iba me to hiyo che, ebi ebi. So deconstruction actually uh, creates a form of metaphysics of presence. What is metaphysics of presence? I will do bola chista. So words have meaning only because of the contrast effects with other words no word can acquire meaning in the way in which philosophers from aristotle to bartrand russell have hoped it might by being unmediated expression of the something non linguistic er kono kono word kono din unmediated expression of the non linguistic hisebe kono din mane hote pare na word kibhabe mane hoy at the structure as all the structuralists propounded that through a kind of creating a kind of differences Uh, endless differences without any positive terms. For example, at the word "tokuni," I mean, what's it? Cat, bat, rat, sat. It is not. Kikura, I mean, what's it? The paradigm in the middle. The word "gula" for for is singular. I mean, what's it? The word "gula" for for is not shadi. The paradigm in the middle. That is the word "gula" in the middle. I mean, what's it? The word "to choose" for is the paradigm. Cat, rat, bat, sat, man. It is not. Every single word is different. I mean, it is different. I mean, it is different. फर्म के धारणा An ideal Platonic form, both the the idea of the crow itself or the idea of the human being. I mean, all of them go to such natural manus, no? Ki shoto the ideal form. So, there is the ideal form. It is a key. Both them an essential violence. There is the both the mechanism. Or else, can he air mode the? He bigger mode the? Nothing to do with the metaphysics of presence seed. A violent hierarchy creation of seed. Can I? I mean, we are essentially at the origin of the body. कजित Propounded by Descartes, the idea of the ideal form of mind, rest cogitans and rest extensa, human body. Tell us, tell us, tell us, tell us. They have what they want. They have just only the mind control. What they have. For the age of the essential origination, can we clearly bar for the thinking or the intellectual origin point? Key mind, not matter. Age can be both in metaphysics of presence, and as a consequence, meaning. Is never present, but rather is deferred to the science. The reason is, I mean, it's what we call them structuralist philosophy. It's a very good explanation. The actor meaning, how many 
meaning system and the code way of it at the entire system of differences at a structure a language is a play of differences without any positive terms cat cat no I bad bad no I mad mad no I the current you will protect I protect the money to get acquired for check a at the system of difference and what they exist for it so meaning is never present meaning is always essentially absent for the first time western metaphysical tradition the challenge for the visible low meaning is never present meaning is always absent and is rather deferred to other science is already being postponed in a port to get the other one of the port to give money to our sure sure get to do it there is a reference refers to this belief uh, in this new mystical that there is a self-sufficient non-deferred meaning as the metaphysics of presence so is self-sufficient non-deferred meaning and the key there is a whole metaphysics of presence key key metaphysics of presence an example for example god can be treated as a metaphysics of present because it is the transcendental signified transcendental signified one key you don't money to act i only will signify no one what one will the kunta bojo what one will be bojo in the boy will take for other with the only key to ask about it from our mother with a book will take for example first semester second semester for the last of the Gita as the very poor and as the very Bible as the very book money going on it Bobo and all the game at the act or only Bobo and the transcendental signified is that form of signified which doesn't has a kind of signifier that will signify the concept of the world is for it to the old there is a like a political a hugely deconstruct for it was a naturally transcendental signifier and would do on a coronary play of signifiers okay for it so aj self-sufficient non-deferred meaning and the meat of searching the origin point is the metaphysics of presence so concept then must be understood in the context of the opposite such as being and appearance normal abnormal speech and writing age of dualism major dichotomy the opposite at the western philosophy shop for a clear for a check and we opposite and what they are the day they connect the opposite to choose for the b nothing the same of the media and the being to choose for the western philosophy normal to choose for the abnormal to choose for dinner speech to choose for the writing to choose for dinner age of valorization of one form of binary in the sphere of opposites it again there is a version metaphysics of presence which are presence is such good the show was to do a check I'm only looking at the absence you could do the marginalize such you know that I mean I wanted to know who that to start with you know so they did a bull no job only come on meaning making system and what they I mean essentially to the horror of in between music today but for the time and I'm okay and if all of the media music of me to give up a look at it but we in the dark in the minute for the door we need to get the phone I mean a particular dichotomy would they want to act like a valorize for one I mean essentially at a system of play at a is at a system of ambivalence and will be introduced for more how you know true false right left west is male female mind body inside outside positive negative a dichotomy western philosophy of my period for it actually so there is a contents that in a classical philosophical position we are not dealing with the peaceful coexistence and vis-a-vis -vis, but rather with a violent hierarchy i've already said it the first task of deconstruction would be to find and overturn these oppositions inside a text or a thought as a text prothom kaj ki is to overturn is to attack this violent hierarchy which is always already resides inside the text the shock on a text and what they do get was a she violent had a bit of a between the signifier and the signifier with an intelligible over sensible speech over writing activity over facility aj at the dichotomy created away at a long at the game just a prefer for tea i mean the interactive technology i mean signified a signifier at the machine but you know from it a home on certain common is she tied and signify on it on it to the way signified on a what the way grasp for the opportunity to aj opposition money or check at the metaphysics of presence deconstruction she made a piece of presence to the other just a little introducing the leader uh would have to be cut a boy to it 
a graphic guide by Jeff Collins and Bill uh, and Bill Mayblin. Like a penguin, like a public show, but it's a very good boy. I mean, all the most famous chubby boys. So, she will be used to my PowerPoint and stuff like that. I must extend my heartfelt thanks, my heartfelt gratitude to them. So, how many binary opposition are there? For example, uh, being and non-being cast the key terms against their opposites. If the question is being, establish being against non-being. Being the key will be established. Corbe to me, meaning that it. Non-being are against it. To me, light the key will be established. Corbe, darkness are against it. Let there be light, and there was light. Bible it. Adam shuru dikhe Genesis se pata. Let there be light, and there was light. Aage chilo ki. An abyss, a darkness, darkness ke aage dekha rahe hain. Tar pore light kar, light ki importance ke dekha rahe hain. Darkness ke baare dekha thiye. So kuch mai mind ke importance ke dekha rahe hain, jo body ke dekha thiye hain. Presence ke dekha thiye hain, absence na tak likhi hai. And privilege the first time. Kuch mai taashir phalo, taashir paatar je pratham shabdo dekhe, shere ke phalo rise karo, dikhe dekhe. Mane, odi hoche ground dikhe, first a positive term. Give it priority, prioritize it. The main side of the logos. Logos means word, the word of God. Bhagavan is shabdo che logos. I mean, mukhe bolla, Bhagavan ke confirm kolla Bhagavan. Tumi thikka ta bolche to Bhagavan bolle hai re. I mean, bolchi. I mean, amar shabdo ta Bible er shabdo ta amari shabdo. So, is a confirmation of the presence. It is in the bolche. And then subordinate the second. And then set up a procedure. Chido kali shabshon hai, e prathom term ta privatize kore. E ki prioritization er process. E le ki dhenida gochan metaphysics of presence. So, all the metaphysicians proceed from an origin. Gochi origination er me. Jeta Plato korchan, jeta kono kaki kagma hai, kake dharo na ta shokto, dharo na te phire jao. Genesis ote genesis maane ki? Origin point, genesis. Kino de begin hoche. Prithi ni kemaan kore create hoche, God create korche, shat din. So all metaphysicians proceed from an origin seen as simple, intact, normal, pure, standard, self-identical. To treat then of the accidents, derivation, complication, deterioration, hence good before evil. So what about the accident, derivation, complication, decay, deterioration, what about the origin point is pure truth. So, so, and hence this process of promoting good before evil. This process of promoting, sorry, good before the evil. Process of promoting uh, uh, positive before negative. Pure before impure, simple before complex. This is not just one metaphysical gesture among others. It is the metaphysical exigence, so the most constant, profound, and potent procedure. Metaphysics shoshoni etai kore akta ke arakaro pore promote kore. This is the most potent metaphysical procedure. So deconstruction looks for the ways the elements in literature contradict each other. Word, what are the basic premises of deconstruction? That words cannot express meaning. Every utterance contains a lie by omitting all other possible utterances. Protect utterance is committing a form of lie. The myth of the Karan, okay, the other way, the utterance, utter which will be utter for a pishone, politics. What is the main politics of representation behind which exists behind, uh, behind almost erasing? All other forms of utterances, only forms of utterances can can we erase from which we teach? I mean, just only Arjuna talk about it. That means we essentially can honor Arjuna with a coal, hill, shanta, lumina. That is what I mean. China, that to Arjuna, so much of a text. That is a Vedan. Upanishad. Upanishad. That is what I mean. Essentially, Arjuna ritual. That is what I mean. That means honor Arjuna with a ritual. China. That is honor Arjuna. That means we exist. What to? What to? Abushi. What to? That is she. Tadir voice ta kothai galo? Kothai galo? Ej unuttered voices of those who are marginalized. Shita ke kujye bheer kora nami hoche deconstruction. So interpretations in deconstruction are sometimes very bizarre and conflicted. 
in the creative deconstruction of main art. So deconstructionists always focus on how language is used to achieve power. What is the main what are the main relate, relate, relational points between language and power? Since they believe in the words of the famous critic David Lehman that they are the truths. Only rival interpretations. There is no fixed truth. On truth, knowledge, one of the only rival interpretation. Shotto bolle kicho hai na. Rupa Mishra mein bikha to gaan chilo. Shotti bolle shotti kicho. Kuthra ham shotto bolle kicho hai na. Only rival interpretations. I mean, shudhu matro backhar bhinno ta dite pari. Bhinno habe backhar korte pari. So, what are the basic philosophical concern and principles of deconstruction? First. A desire to contribute to the evaluation of all Western values, a re-evaluation built on the 18th century Kantian critic of pure reason Kant, 18th century that is the most important thing. Vishuddha Buddhi Shalosha, Vishuddha Buddhi Shalosha, critic of pure reason, Vishuddha Buddhi will be the one. Reason and modi, unreason, that is reason and modi, enigmatic elements, that is reason and modi, mysteries, that is 18th century was the age of enlightenment and mystery. Oi, aj Gothic fiction lekha hote chhe. Oi, aj Dracula ko tha bola hote chhe. Oi, aj shop theke beshi horror and suspense literature kore hote chhe. Oi, oi, aj pratham Gothic novel likche. Gothic architecture kore hote chhe. Oh, enlightenment age. Because naturally, I mean, the actor side that guy, reason age of age of prose and reason. That which one side is essentially that be enigmatic mystery. I mean, I have done just a couple of things. But a Kantian text, but but romanticism here, I mean, that's the foundation, critical purism, which is the most beautiful one. And then. देरीतर में इनका जी चिलो ये समस्त कैनोनिकल वेस्टर्न टेक्स्ट कुलो बी डिमेंडुअल कांट्स टेक्स्ट बी द टेक्स्ट ऑफ द नीचे और किस के गार्ड 19 सेंचुरी टेक्स्ट एक रूप में रीरीड करा ए जे मेटाफिक्स ऑफ प्रेजेंस एंड मुद्दे एब्सेंस ऑफ पॉइंट कुलो के ये बार कोड़ा बार कोड़े आना सो देर इस that the death of the author is the corollary to the birth of the reader. Manu Jormat se reader ne Jormat grown hote se reader Jormat chhutu mare reader chhutu mare text ke poche and become part of a set of cultural habits equal to if not surpassing the importance of the authorial intent. Authorial intent ke guru tuliyo na do not become mane part of the tradition that always valorizes the authorial intent. Shakespeare, Shakespeare, की भेबे हैमलेट लिखे चुके हम लोग तो जानी ना, हमने आमादेर मोतो को हैमलेट की इंटरप्रेट कोरी, ठीक है ना? So a very important point in discussing the construction, there is always a loud assertion that texts always outlive their authors, and the evaluation of certain classic Western dialectics, dialectics की की दोनों की की, poetry versus philosophy, reason versus revelation. Structure versus creativity, epistemy versus creativity, poetry and philosophy. At a logic, what I say, at a reason, unreasonable, what I say. At a boy, what I say, for a logic, for a structure, what I mean, reason, reason, what I mean, revelation, revelation, what I mean, for example, the revelation of God, epiphany. Look, you know, what I mean, hello, flashing of the of the light. I mean, when we see the baby in the manger, little one, me, just here, I see the first time Christ. So that's revelation. So reason versus revelation, structure versus creativity, epistemy versus technique. Technique is a technical thing. Epistemy, knowledge, classical form of the knowledge, and technique is craftsmanship. Okay. So age of binary, such as we exist, coach, Western philosophy, the type of revaluation, rethinking, revaluate. For another one, what we have seen, age of the deconstruction is quite a basic principle. For example. एक जब बहुत लोग के दिखते बच्चों दूधी के दूजों ए ही पर्टिकुलर छोभी टा नया हुए चे रैफाइल एर आका विख्यात हो छोभी द स्कूल ऑफ एथेंस व्हिच इज पेंटेड एस अ फ्रेस्को इन इटैली तो ए जे बहुत लोग ये बहुत लोग के नाम हो चुन प्लेटो यू ऑल नो आई वी ड्रोड्यूस्ड यू एंड दिस इज एरिस्टोटल हिज 
সে পেন্টিং একটু ভালোভাবে দেখতে পাবে যে প্লেটোর হাতটা রয়েছে ওপর দিকে এবং অ্যারিস্টলের তলার দিকে প্লেটো ইজ হোল্ডিং আ কপি অফ হিজ রিপাবলিক ইফ ইউ জুম ইন ইউ উইল সি and uh, aristotle is holding his copy of the nicomachean ethics which is a very canonical uh, book of ethics perhaps one of the foundation book of ethics niti vidyar ekdom prathom dik kar lekha nicomachean ethics to plato tar sara jibone prochur dialogue likheche to ei dialogue gulo prottek bari kono na kono philosophical critic ekta mane essentially uh, uh, নন পলিটিক্যাল দৃষ্টিভঙ্গি দিয়ে ইন্টারপ্রেট করেছে ডায়ালগ একটা এসেন্সিয়াল ফিলোসফিক্যাল এন্টিটি থট এক্সারসাইজ বা থট এক্সপেরিমেন্ট হিসেবে বেশিরভাগ ক্রিটিকি ডায়ালগকে দেখেছেন এনি ফর্ম অফ ডায়ালগ রিটেন বাই প্লেটো সেটা আমাদের ক্রিটোই হোক বা মেনোই হোক বা হি রোড ভেরিয়াস ডায়ালগস রিপাবলিক হোক হি রোড ফিদ্রাস যাই গিয়ে ডায়ালগ হোক না কেন দেরি দ্য ফোর দ্য ফার্স্ট টাইম হি Uh, look back into the influence of the Plato and his influence on the Western metaphysical tradition. And like Nietzsche, there is a suspect Plato of dissimulation in the service of the political project. Plato banished all the poets from his ideal conception of Republic. He said that the poet are, poets are not at all fit for uh, ruling a particular country. Who is then fit for ruling a particular country or handling uh, state craftsmanship? philosopher he he said deri da prothom bar bollo er pishone definitely plato ra ekta kono political project royeche ei dialogue keno lekha hocche bhai dialogue er keno existence hocche nishchoi plato ke ekta mogoj dholai er ba onno der ki influence korar machine hisebe contemporary athens tech machinery hoto use koreche as a political project in the name of education educate korar name so that a particular class of citizens more strategically positioned to influence the police police vritto nagor rashtra chilo onekulo chotto chotto nagor rashtra niye toiri kota grip rashtra tader citizen der moddhe theke ekta amon citizen create kora jay jara jaderke rashtra chakkore niyontron korte parbe kintu tar moddhe prochur rupturing point ba disrupting point naturally thakbei pockets of resistance thakbei grand narrative er moddhe chotto chotto micro narrative created hobei kintu plato hoyto ei rokom bhabe plato ke use korechilo hoyto at a particular form of government there is a position so there is the reading of plato in this way can be treated as an example of deconstructive reading deconstructive can or a binary opposition ke baire it tries to see the origin or foundation uh, in a completely different way it tries to unravel the foundation in a deconstructive way it tries to unravel the ambiguity is inside that that resides inside the text of plato এইভাবে অপারেট করে মেটাফিজিক্স অফ প্রেজেন্স এইভাবে অপারেট করে যে কোনো একটা ডিকনস্ট্রাকটিভ রিডিং এই যে দুটো কথা অত্যন্ত ইম্পর্টেন্ট কথা ডেরি দাস রাইটিং ইউজ আ র্যাডিক্যাল ক্রিটিক অফ ফিলোসফি সি আর আই টি আই কিউ ইউ ই ক্রিটিক মানে ইভ্যালুয়েশন সমালোচনা ক্রিটিক মানে ক্রিটিক্যাল লেন্স দেখা ইটস আ র্যাডিক্যাল ক্রিটিক অফ দ্য ওয়েস্টার্ন ফিলোসফি ইটস কোয়েশ্চেন্স দ্য ইউজুয়াল নোশনস অফ ট্রুথ অ্যান্ড নলেজ বললাম এটা তো সত্যি বলে সত্যি কিছু নেই কোনো ওয়ান ফিক্সড ফর্ম অফ নলেজ বলে কোনো নলেজ হয় না দের আর অলওয়েজ অলরেডি মাল্টিফেরিয়াস মিনিংস অ্যান্ড ইট ডিসরাপস ট্র্যাডিশনাল আইডিয়াস অ্যাবাউট প্রসিডিওর অ্যান্ড প্রেজেন্টেশন কোনো একটা পার্টিকুলার নোশন অফ প্রেজেন্টেশন একটা প্রসিডিওর কোনো প্রসিডিওর হয় না মাল্টি ডাইমেনশনাল প্রসিডিওর হয় অ্যান্ড ইট কোয়েশ্চেন্স দ্য অথরিটি অফ ফিলোসফি দর্শনের যে অথরিটি তাই নিয়ে প্রথম প্রশ্ন ছিল ভেরি the constructive interpretation always holds that the entire history of the western philosophy with its language and traditions has emphasized the desire for immediate access to meaning plato dialogue kashone ta hocche remember plato and with his another set of students jane plato is himself present she uposthit royeche as the sole metaphysical authority he will himself explain and hence uh, it, it, it is called as dialogues ডায়ালগ হচ্ছে যেখানে প্লেটো নিজে প্রেজেন্ট রয়েছেন যদি প্লেটো নিজে প্রেজেন্ট না থাকতো যদি রিটেন ফর্মে হতো যদি এপিস্টোলারি ফর্ম্যাটে হতো চিঠি চিঠি পত্রের ফর্ম্যাটে তাহলে ন্যাচারালি তার মধ্যে এসেন্সিয়ালি মিস কমিউনিকেশন মিস রিডিং হতো সেটা হতে যাবে না এর ফলে দি হিস্ট্রি অফ দ্য ওয়েস্টার্ন ফিলোসফি উইথ ইটস ল্যাঙ্গুয়েজ এন্ড ট্র্যাডিশন ইজ অলওয়েজ দি হিস্ট্রি অফ দি ইমিডিয়েট অ্যাক্সেস টু মিনিং আমার এক্ষুনি এটার মানে বলতে হবে এটার মানে চাই প্লেটো মানে বলে দেবে এটার তবে এটার মানে এটাই হবে 
একটা সিগনিফায়ার মানে একটাই সিগনিফায়ার মাল্টিপল সিগনিফায়ার্স নয় অনেকগুলো মানে হবে না স্ক্রিনে একটু দেখলেই বুঝতে পারবে প্লেটো প্রেজেন্ট আছে প্লেটোর স্টুডেন্ট প্রেজেন্ট আছে প্লেটো যা বলছে স্টুডেন্ট শুনতে বাধ্য স্টুডেন্ট যা বলছে প্লেটো তা শুনতে বাধ্য একে অপরকে এক্সপ্লেন করে দিচ্ছে একটা এসেনশিয়ালি স্টেবল মিনিং সিস্টেম ক্রিয়েট করছে একটা শব্দের অনেকগুলো মানে মাল্টিপল ইন্টারপ্রিটেশনস হচ্ছে না ন্যাচারালি এই জায়গাতেই এই যে ডিজায়ার ফর অ্যাক্সেস টু দ্য ইমিডিয়েট মিনিং এইটার কথাই রিকনস্ট্রাকশন করছে এখান থেকেই আসছে দেবীদের বিখ্যাত শব্দ লোগো সেন্ট্রেসিং যেটা আমাদের সিলেবাসে রয়েছে আমি অলরেডি প্রথম দেখেছি তোমাদের সিলেবাসের মধ্যে বাইনারি অপোজিশন রয়েছে বাইনারি অপোজিশন থাকতে বলে দেখেছো লোগো সেন্ট্রেসিং তোমাদের সিলেবাসের মধ্যে কোয়েশ্চেন পড়ার সম্ভাবনা খুবই বেশি কারণ টার্মটা মেনশন করা আছে So, Logo Centrism is a term coined by the German philosopher Ludwig Klages. Ludwig Klages, for the first time, used it uh, in the 1920s. Later, they did the popularization. So, it refers to the tradition of the Western science and philosophy that regards words and language as a fundamental expression of an external reality. It holds that Logos as epistemologically superior and there is an original irreducible object which logos represents logos mane word the word of god bhagwaner mukhonishrito bani eta bhagwan hote pare ramkrishna hote pare onno je kono kichu hote pare logosynthism mane word centric or speech centric not written word centric likhito shobdo noy logosynthism manei hocche mukher bani logos ami bollam let there be light god said let there be light and there was light shonge shonge alo elo karon bhagwaner mukhonishito bani to je light aste hobe the light shonge shonge elo so age valorizing the word the presence of god somosto dhoroner mythology somosto er form of theology any form of practice religion a valorization of the word of god thakbei এটা কি দেবিতা বলছে ঘৃণা করো ঈশ্বরকে ঘৃণা করো নয় কোন ধরনের অথরিটিকে ঘৃণা করো ঈশ্বরকে যেভাবে তার ব্যবসায়ী দেবতার মানুষ জন্য প্রচার করছে গডকে যেভাবে আনছে তার সামনে রিপ্রেজেন্টেশন অফ দ্য গড সেটাকে কোয়েশ্চেন করো এই ওয়ার্ডটাকে এই একটা শব্দ যে বললাম এই শব্দের একটা সিঙ্গল ইন্টারপ্রিটেশন মনোলিথিক ইন্টারপ্রিটেশন অফ দ্য ওয়ার্ড তাকে ঘৃণা করো তাকে কোয়েশ্চেন করো So in the beginning was the word and the word was with God and the word was God. Shabdui Bhagavan, Shabdui Brahma, what is that? John uh, part 1, uh, Old Testament, sorry, New Testament. Vikkhata Shabdo, Logosynthism, Srima Kothito, Chattak Kore, Srima Kothito Kothito Kothito. What is Sri Sri Ram Krishna Kothamrito, Vada Vada Kore. Kek Bole Che Bola Dorka Ni, Srima Kothon Kore, Chattak Srima Hai Likhe Che, Srima Kothito. श्रीकृष्ण एवं अर्जुन से मुखनश्रुत बाणी गीता रामकृष्ण যদি লেখা পড়ি রামকৃষ্ণের রিটেন ওয়ার্ডস এই বইয়ের মধ্যে হয়তো রামকৃষ্ণের কথা হয়েছে আমি পড়তে আরম্ভ করলাম রামকৃষ্ণ তো সামনে নেই জিজ্ঞেস করবো কেমন করে তখনই কনফিউশন তখনই অ্যাম্বিভ্যালেন্স তখনই অ্যাম্বিগুইটি অ্যাম্বিগুইটি মানেই হচ্ছে মিস রিডিং মিস রিডিং মানেই হচ্ছে মিনিং মেকিং সিস্টেম ফল্টে করতে আরম্ভ করবে ভক্ত আর ভক্ত থাকবে না ভগবানকে প্রশ্ন করতে আরম্ভ করবে তখনই সমস্ত হয়ে যাবে ফলে লোগো সেন্ট্রিজমে বিলিভ করো in the western eastern any form of theology any form of mysticism so this is the famous quotation of derrida about logocentrism so according to derrida all metaphysicians from plato 
to Rusho, Dekarte to Huzal have proceeded in this way, considering good to be to be before evil, the positive before the negative, the pure before the impure, the simple before the complex, the essential before the accident, the immediate before the imitation. That's how the logocentrism operates. Good ki evil era gano, positive ki negative era gano, pure ki impure era gano. Tash khala daga chilam, unta aage thak be, unta pore thak be. So, phonocentrism, phonos, ucharan and logocentrism, basically the same. Always valorizes the presence of thought. According to Derrida, when speech fails to protect presence, when speech fails to protect presence, when speech fails to protect writing becomes necessary. And in this case, writing then serves as a supplement, a new word, very important word, supplement. Amara jakun dieting korte parina properly, amara jakun carbohydrate, fat, protein, direct natural food source teke parina jakun amara kikori, supplement kai, insure kai, pediasure kai, holdix kai, these are all supplement. So writing is basically a supplement to speech, not that pure as speech.